Hey, yo, what's good with y'all boys, man? Y'all boys already know what time it is, man. I got to drop this banger-ass dribble tut, man. I'm not about to lie. I'm gonna put y'all boys on how to combo up in season one, the best guard seeds. My bad, the best tall guard seeds, the fastest tall guard seeds. Y'all boys already know what time it is, bro. I ain't even finna waste no time. I'm finna show y'all boys what seeds I'm about to be going over in this video. I'm about to hop straight into it. Nah, these are seeds I'm about to be going over. Pro Dribble Star, Rafal Austin, six sides of D-Fox Breakdown Combo, Murray, um, Aggressive Breakdown, Trey Young Escape Comp. Y'all already see all that. Bro, bro, now first thing first y'all boys gonna want to know man y'all boys have to know how to hit y'all momentum dribble bro now they changed it from last year it's not oh you flick a right stick up in your left stick up diagonal this year you still can hold r2 because it's way easier for me still and you don't lose adrenaline bar so you don't got to worry about that all you got to do is hold r2 this year flick your right stick to the left and flick your left stick uh up left diagonal if i said that right yup then you just do it same way opposite. I mess up on the dribble more. I got bad stick that I'm not gonna lie. So my fault, man. Second thing, bro, is the snatch back. A lot of niggas wonder how the fuck do you do the snatch back. Niggas think you do this. Nah, bro, you gonna get your breakdown combos, bro. How you do the snatch back this year, bro? You hold R2, you flick your right stick to the right, you flick your left stick down. All right, <clears throat> now we're gonna go over the um, signature size of Rafal Austin. It's still pretty much the same as last year. You don't want to get this move because this is the slowest move out of it. It's still the same tween. You want to do this, you want to flick your uh, right stick left and right literally between your legs. Same thing pretty much. And the behind the back is still the same. All you're doing to get this behind the back is flicking your right stick down diagonal if it's in your right hand or left diagonal if it's in your left hand. Nah, this is how you hit the momentum and then hit the behind the back at the same time and chain it. This is what I'm talking about. It's gonna look like this. How you do that is, you wanna remember, hit your momentum, you wanna hold R2, flick your right stick to the left, flick your left stick up diagonal. And then once you do that, you're gonna wanna flick your right stick right down diagonal. Or if you got the ball on your left hand, you're gonna wanna flick your, um, you wanna hold R2, flick your right stick to the right, Left stick up right diagonal, then flick your right stick back to the left to get that behind the back. Oh, another thing too, release R2 after you're done with your momentum. I'll be forgetting to tell y'all that, my bad, bro. Release R2 after you're done with your momentum. Because if you don't, it's gonna look like this. Me. Next up is the Hezzy boost or the speed boost, however you want to call it. A lot of y'all boys have a problem with speed boost and y'all don't know how to speed boost, bruh. Y'all swear it's simple this year. Put on Scotty Pippen, um, hesitation if you on a taller build than a six, if you taller than a six, if you taller than, if you taller than six foot or six five, I think. If you like at least six six or somewhere around there. If you at least six foot or under, toss on Kyrie Irving or Kyrie Irving dribble style or Kyrie Irving hesitation with whichever one. You my height, bro, toss on Scotty Pippen. All you doing to get this um, hesitation boost, what I'm talking about is this. What I'm doing for that is, bro, I'm holding my R2, I'm flicking my right stick to the right, and then I'm um, dragging my left stick down diagonal. And it's the same way, the opposite way. So remember, you wanna hold R2, flick your right stick to the right, and uh, drag, hold your um, left stick down diagonal. And this is a good move to create space so you can drive to the paint or you can three these hunt. That's simple. Once again, like last year, pretty much the uh, misdirections are still the same. All you want to do is you want your R2, the ball your left hand, you want to flick your right stick to the right, your left stick to the left. Down diagonal if you want the behind the back misdirection. But the move I'll be doing a lot is like I'll hit a crab, 
hit a misdirection and then run back. How to do that is, bro, once again, you wanna hold your R2, stick your right stick, up right diagonal. You wanna hit your misdirection after you hit the crab. So you wanna flick your right stick to the left, then your left stick to the right to get that. Then once you get done with the behind the back, you wanna hold R2 still. Hold R2, um, yeah, you wanna hold R2 after you've done with the uh, misdirection behind the back. Then you wanna hold your left stick down so you'll run back. And then bam, that's how you do the move. Another thing too, you don't have to release R2. You can hold R2 this whole time while you're doing it. If y'all boys are just wonder. Last thing too, before I wrap this shit up, bro. Another thing I pee with the pro dribble style, bro. You get to be able to hit this. I don't know if you can do this with all other uh, dribble styles, but I did notice you can hit this out of the pro dribble style. I guess you could say it's come some kind of like misdirection or I don't know. Y'all always tell me what y'all think this can do. I don't know. I might start doing this. I ain't gonna lie. Feel what I'm saying? Oh yeah, I forgot one last thing too. How to hit your step back. This year you don't hold R2 to hit your step back so you'll be able to do it. You'll They make you do a snatch back basically. All you do is just don't hold R2 and flick your right stick down. Boom. That's how you get your step back. Simple as that. And it's the same way you want to hit a moving step back. Say you want to go to the left. You want to hold your R2. Flick your left stick. Flick your right stick to the left or whatever direction you want to go. You want to hold your left stick. Boom. Flick your right stick down. That's how you get that. Another thing too, bro. I forgot, bro. How you hit your breakdown combos. This is how you hit the regular breakdown combo. All you do is flick your right stick up. Boom, you'll get that animation. And how you hit your aggressive breakdown combos, you wanna hold R2, do the exact same thing. All right, bro, that's pretty much a wrap for this dribble tour. I hope y'all boys got that thoroughly, bro. I'll be trying my hardest to explain that shit, bro. That shit do not be easy, bro. But uh, smash that like button, bro. If this tutorial helps you, man. Hey, old bangers is on the way real soon, bro. I'ma fuck with y'all boys in the next video. Baby,